What is up, everybody? My name is Augment, also better known as Augie, and I am going to do my Minecraft theology. So I have to kind of give you guys a little bit of information about who I am. I am a junior at Nebraska Christian College in Papillion, Nebraska. I am a father of two boys. One is eight and one is seven. I also am the husband of a beautiful bride, wife person who I love very much and think that she's amazing. I am also a youth pastor at Northwest Christian Church in Council Bluffs, Iowa, which is across the river from us. And I am also the resident tech guy, meaning I'm the on-call guy on campus for internet and other technology issues at the college I am attending. And all that means is I wear lots of hats and I have lots and lots of things to do during the school year, including homework, making sure that people are getting the stuff they're able to do or need to be able to do, and also ensuring that I'm spending time with my family while doing ministry. Uh, and it's a lot of hats to juggle, but I'm very thankful that God made me ADHD so I can juggle them. So, I started video gaming way back in the day when the Atari was pretty much one of the biggest systems out there, and then the Commodore 64, and then television. I would go to friends' houses and play Pitfall and all those games and packs and pong. My first video game system that I actually owned was a Nintendo Entertainment System when I was 10 years old. I played a lot of Mario. A lot of Mario. Uh, one, two, three. I also played a lot of a game called Star Tropics. Uh, and I tried to beat it so many times and got so, so, so. Beyond that, I didn't really own a gaming system again until the Xbox 360. But in between that, I found uh, PC gaming and found some, some solace in PC gaming, like... The games you don't know, Jack. I loved those games. They made fun of you and, and made you feel really bad about yourself sometimes. But they were a lot of fun and I enjoyed the heck out of them. And I also played a lot of the Rainbow Six Rogue Spear series that was the originals on the PC back in the early 2000s. During the Xbox 360, though, I ended up playing a lot Burnout Paradise, a lot of Call of Duty, and got pretty decent at both. And I still say Burnout Paradise is the best arcade racing game ever because you literally can pick it up and play it. It's just that easy. Uh, I enjoyed the heck out of those games. Unfortunately, when I started to adopt my kids, I really felt that God was calling my heart to not be getting involved with certain things like video games, and so I kind of gave up video games for a while. Uh, and then I got into Minecraft, where I really found that there's a great opportunity for a ministry to be done in it, and also for a community to be built. I, by the way, dug all of this out. And, and the nice part about that is that I really saw that there was something that you could do because you could do it together, but I also felt that it was something that we all could make amazing things, too. I'm not the amazing thing maker, but I, I felt that we could do that. And when I saw that Church Mag was looking for some people to join their thing and server here, I, I kind of jumped at the opportunity because I've been playing Minecraft by myself or with a couple people here on campus, but... I hadn't really been playing it a lot and having really a purpose to play it. And I, I got into this server way later than everybody else. And at first I was kind of like, oh, but I kind of like where I'm at now because I have this opportunity to, to build and do things. Like this used to be a giant hill that went all the way up to where the glass was. And that used to be a giant hill too that I cleared out. And then there used to be a giant hill in water. I cleared all that out. But I, I say all that because it's nice to have a community that we can get together and kind of purposefully have fun. And, and I hope that this grows into something where we can play together with other people and, and do things that are a lot of fun together with other people. Uh, I think there's a community aspect to Minecraft that is often overlooked in video games. 
Um, but I think starting to make a comeback in video games. Beyond that, interest-wise, I love music and concert, and I think that I love them a little too much sometimes, and I love to go to concerts a little too much. But I think there's something about video games that you don't get at other things to wrap all that up. I mean, you can go to concerts, and there's a community there at the concert, and you can go to other kinds of things, but there's something about video games, for me, that you just don't get elsewhere. You don't get the attitude of certain things elsewhere. What you get sometimes doesn't always mean what, what you need to be getting. And so I think for me, video games really adds a way of me being able to just relax and turn my brain off in the aspect of not having to worry about certain things and just kind of relaxing for a little bit and at downtime attitude is what I would call that, just like a downtime atmosphere for me, which I need to do with all the hats that I juggle and all the other things that I'm in part of and getting involved with and working on things. I feel that it's nice to be able to just log in and, and have fun on the server, but also getting things done. I'm very, very, very thankful for that. I'm very thankful for these guys letting me get on the server because there were a couple times I came in and I was pretty sure they didn't like it. And I'm okay with it. It's working together as a team, whether you like what they're doing or not. Anyways, this has been my Minecraft theology. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you stick around and look at all the other videos they have if you haven't. And if you've gotten to mine last, well, go watch them again because they're, they're worth it. Have a great and wonderful day. Bye! Hey, this is where you leave.